here at uh, Blackwood. Everybody now forming up. As they come now through the final corner, Tommy Oscar leads the field. Kenneth O'Keefe next to him. Lublin and Speedo behind as they come onto the pit straight now. Everyone forming up. Ooh, it's, there's a, where's Lublin Racing going? In third place, they're alongside Green Flag Waves. Look at Kenneth O'Keefe, he's way past Tommy Oscar before they've even started. Further back, yeah, he's and, um, back between Lublin. Down the inside goes um, Sepam. Look at all oh, contact oh. from Racing Radicals. Spinning, spinning, spinning. Oh, step on. There's somebody else in the middle Todorovic. of the road, and that's uh, Serbian Chrome Prisk Pistons. Todorovic, yep. He gets stuck in the middle of the track. Kind of thought Keith, though. He was miles past Tommy Oscar out Paul Sitter before the uh, green flag went out. What was all that about? I was watching that specifically since that was my driver, and uh, yeah, he was. I mean, he was. He even delayed the start after he was in front because he was in front and Tommy just I don't know to me it didn't look like he didn't go I'd have to go back and look at the replay I don't want to you know say anything I don't know what's true yet but uh yeah, that past. doesn't seem to be the case yeah Tommy, uh, Tommy Oscar just being led past there by Kenneth O'Keefe coming down the main straight and uh, Tommy Oscar for 7 Racing takes the lead yep there we go no but O'Keefe coming down Keith the inside again, again. Coming in the final corner. Can't make the move stick though. Further back, it's all sort of clean, I suppose. There's somebody off on the final corner. That was lost a lot of time. That was Beckham. Or Beckham, I believe it's pronounced. But now a three car battle for the lead. Oscar, O'Keefe, and. Uh, Mason. Yep, Mason of Sonic Realms Racing. Now behind Kenneth O'Keefe, closest battle on the track now, I think. That's for second place, which is brilliant. Lubin Racing behind them lost quite a lot of time over the past lap or two. Ooh, Myers off in the grass on the final corner on the straight. He's going to lose multiple positions here, but he's back on track. Yep, there he is, a very, very lovely skin as well, as Collier and Dahl go side by side, coming down the pit straight, not the pit straight, the back straight. Kenneth O'Keefe takes the lead. Yes. Yeah, made an outside pass going into the chicane, I did, really didn't think that was going to work, but he pulled it off, just had enough clearance. And side oh, Mason falls to Mason. Yeah, exactly. Seidel of uh, Four Strokes Racing Team. They take third place, but um, make contact with Mason as well in the final corner, who is now almost side by side with Roselli, who's just got the fastest lap in an FXR. Oh, Mason off Ooh, again. Ma Look how wide he is coming out that Where is he going? Going for a picnic, is Mr. Mason. And again. Yet again, almost. Oh, Ros Ooh, Roselli cutting across him. Oh. And Realms is in a lot of places now. Yeah, he'll be lucky not to fall to eighth here, but he should be able to maintain this spot if he can get a good draft. Oh, look at here, he doesn't have. He doesn't have a draft, and everyone else does. Here comes um, Econon Lombardi behind him. Ooh! Nearly chopped his nose off there, but it was clean. Ooh, what neck oh, look at that! He takes it. Lombardi spun and he took Egan with him. Excite Racing recover. was it? Where are they going to recover? Yep, Excite Racing and Dynamo Racing team. It looks like they're going to end up in 9th and 11th here after that. Really not that bad of a hurt for them when you consider what just happened there, but we'll have to look at the damage and see what they've got. And it's fairly clean. Could Wendt, 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 however, is coming to the pits, the 08 car.
Yep, Collier has also just taken uh, Tafuski for 17th place. That's for Nspin e Esports e Racing, is it? Um, and Infinity Esports Racing. And Kenneth O'Keefe still pulling out a lead on Tommy Osgard. And Osgard goes wide, sideless now. Oh, and Mason oh, turned and around. Mason spun. Yeah, he, he had some help. Couldn't see who it was, but he definitely got turned there, it looked like. Yeah, we oh, just have a really down tough down time down getting going, down. going to. Oh, he's going to fall. Oh, oh and he gets collected. By was that Chadwick? Chadwick? Yeah, it was Chadwick. Chadwick. That was a very Chadwick just lost Chadwick way off the line. Did yeah, you know he just lost way coming around the corner. Hard? I think Chadwick was too early on the ga uh, on the throttle, and then he just spun around. That's what it looked like for me. Yeah, the same here. And Chadwick also blocked messages. Yep, yeah, that that's not a penalty in NDR events, unlike uh, muscle oh. endurance and IGDC. I'm a new. Yeah, meanwhile, here comes Tafoski back on call. Yep. Call you very cautious in that um, in that corner. And the guest team of Sonic. Sonic Realm, so speed of racing behind in that very nice pink version of the um, FZR. Challenging uh, Collier now. Looks to the inside, does he? No. Nope. Tommy Oscar had also lost um, second place to Sadle. We missed that, I'm afraid, did we? I'm afraid so, and Roselli was uh, basically right there with Oscar. Oscar's managed to pull away a bit, but yeah, I'm not sure what happened, but it's obvious something happened that cost him at least two or three seconds minimum. The car does look clean, though. Yeah, no damage at all. Yeah, meanwhile, Sabenko going side by side with Collier. Uh, with the uh, with the length of the straight and the draft you can get from it, you can almost you can almost always pull alongside and pull past before the earth uh, you can. That's also the most healthy decision because side by side through the chicane is always f a thrilling scene. Yeah, but it nearly always doesn't go well. Oh, we're looking to. Uh, Tafoski there, he ran very very wide, defensive line coming into the third corner, third, second corner, Ooh, very sideways and he's on the grass, nearly spins and everybody trying to avoid him, just as holds it on the road does uh, Tafoski. Is that Serbian Hell Drivers? Yes it is I think. Yeah, Serbian Hell Drivers. Yes. yes. That's right. See I'm on form today. <laughs> Good job in preparation mate. <laughs> yeah, meanwhile here is Sim Racing Lithuania team. Minus Tommy Oscar with a very very very, 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 very big draft on Collier. He's coming down the inside, coming in the chicane. Very good overtaking spot the chicane's proved to be over the past um, 10 minutes. And Sim Racing Lithuania team again another place up to 17th now. Up in front we have got a battle for the fourth position between Rosselli and Schneiders. But, uh, 
you're about to see Roselli's. And 